các đầu bếp nấu những cái món truyền thống của họ và những cái món mà họ học được và từ những nguyên liệu của địa phương những người mà họ muốn thử đồ ăn họ sẽ thấy tận mắt những cái nhà đầu bếp này nấu làm sao nguyên liệu kỹ thuật nấu và gia vị We planning to do more new things, but most uh, important one this time, when the chef comes, people like to see their cooking. The big dish is all about, we have a big pot, which is a um, 1.5 meter diameter, and a big fire in front of the audience, all the chef comes and cooks their traditional dishes. Uh, this year we get <laughs> fantastic, this thing, because the big dish in the city, the first time we did that, uh, for charity work. I'm more than happy to do charity. Tasting those dishes and while working with the local chefs, I can always try and pick some some parts of those dishes so that I, I may incorporate them into into dishes that I will be cooking at home and I will be teaching teaching other other chefs at the association to cook at home in Russia. So this is this is all a part of the uh, cultural professional exchange. I mean, from last year to this year, in one year time, I've seen Greek salads in the restaurants in Hoyam. That's mean that I bring one recipe and I take one, not more, one more recipes in my country. That's very good for the for the festival, for the culture, because we change ideas and we use ideas from one to another country. Very easy to find uh, all kinds of fresh locally grown produce to use in uh, my dishes, uh, which is why I decided to come, come here again and make something different. The freshness of these products is great and this will reflect actually a top quality in your final cooked product and this is why people love Vietnamese food. I think it's amazing, it is outstanding, it is very special and it is so tasty that of course we will always come back and back and back again because it's so good. I find the market in here has many kinds of the basil. It's like the original basil, lemon basil and then lemon grass made basil. In Taiwan, just have the one one kind of the basil, and I take a sample in Thailand. It's the sweet basil. So if add this helps in your dishes, you may bring a little bit different flavor for guests. Basically, we we find most yeah I can say 90% of uh, the uh, ingredients here. So which means we are not far away uh, between. Uh, you know, Vietnam, Hoi An and uh, Malaysia. Actually, we normally have all the spices that we want uh, in here. It requires it has the meat, the fish, the, sp uh, the, 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 uh, the uh, fresh herbs, uh, fruits, vegetables, so it has everything. I was impressed about the herbs and uh, and the uh, vegetable that we have and uh, fish are very good. So this is what makes the beauty of Hoi An.
world, the visiting chefs, we learned so much about Vietnam, about Vietnamese food. And I think Koi An is, uh, is old Vietnam. It's, it's marvelous. Just come, learn and then cook. If you are invited to come here, please do. It's, it's a fantastic uh, you know, food festival and uh, much more than I ever expected.